I'm here to talk to students about my book, Eli the Good. The book is set in 1976. It's about a family living in a small southern town. Um, you don't really know for sure where they are. It could be anywhere in the rural south. Um, they're living through the bicentennial summer, shortly after Vietnam. and. Um, it's all from the point of view of a 10-year-old boy who feels like his whole family's falling apart, especially his father, who's a Vietnam veteran with P PTSD. Um, and he feels responsible for holding everybody together. So it's a lot about um, family and patriotism and being a child in the summertime. A big point he was making is how it relates to the families of 9-11 and following that the Iraq war because from that you have almost a new generation of men coming from almost Vietnam war like situations where you have to come back and start a family after going through war and struggling with that uh, PTSD. I think the book is a lot about figuring out how to be good, what it means to be good, a good person. It also deals with um, what it means to be patriotic and different ways of defining that and how it's not just as simple as putting your flag out. I have a new novel coming out in 2018. It's called Little Fire. It's about a man who kidnaps his 11-year-old uh, son and it's about them being on the run from the law across the South. I uh, also got to wander around campus and revisit some of my favorite places. Um, it's just such a beautiful campus and I loved working here. I worked with just the finest people that I've ever worked with and I had such great students. So uh, I definitely miss the people at LMU and I miss the campus, you know what I mean? You couldn't ask for a prettier place to go to school.